back in ETV. Originally from Italy, fresh off a tour of Southern America, mm -hmm. but also fresh off a plane for Berlin. But we've managed to pin her down in London for today's Balcony TV show. It's Violetta Zeroni. How are you doing? Hi, I'm good. How are you? Very good, thank <laughs> you. What song are you going to sing for us today? I'm going to sing a song called Part of Everyone's Game. Great. I hope you enjoy it. Take it away. <laughs> It's lost and incomplete Being someone I couldn't be Who felt like I was part of everyone's skin How to get away from other things that weren't for me We drove for miles And there was give and take So honey, please
amazing, great. Thank you so much, that's great. You. I love your voice, that was really amazing. Thank you very much. Tell us a little bit about that song. When, when did you write it? Uh, the song, actually, I wrote it in Berlin uh, right. almost a year ago. Right. And just because I was in a period of my life where I was writing a lot, but people, labels, management, and right. all the business people were telling me what to do. These songs are not your songs. It's not what you have to do to yeah. be like a pop artist. But I don't want to be, I don't care. I just want to do what I want. And yeah. I, don't want to I don't want to be part of your game. I don't want to be part of everyone's game. I just want to be part of my game. Well, that's a such game. a good way of, of looking at it. How did they respond to that? Surely they would be like, uh, well, uh, this is our game. <laughs> yeah, they did respond like you just said. In fact, it's not easy at all, but we're fighting. So. And is that song out now or is it? Um, have you got music coming out in the UK? It's not out yet. Um, I've just recorded it in London, actually, ah. and it's going to be out in early December. Okay. Uh, together with an EP, yeah. Oh, very exciting. And um, what else is what else can we expect on the EP? Is there a few? How many tracks is there on there? It's going to be four or five tracks, more or less, and I can't reveal the title yet. Is that because there isn't one, or because you're just not allowed? Because I'm undecided between a couple. Okay. Okay. Titles, okay. But, yeah. <laughs> so that's a surprise for for early December. Sort early of time? December, yeah. Oh, cool. And you're fresh off a of plane from Berlin this yeah. morning. Yeah. What were you doing in Berlin? I played a gig in Berlin in a ex shopping center. Very nice. It looked abandoned, but it wasn't at all. An ex shopping center. Was there a lot of people there? Uh, yeah, a lot of people. Was it was there? like an art exposition. Oh, cool. Really cool. Yeah. How did it go? How do the people in Berlin um, sort of take? Do they like your music? I love Berlin audience. I love yeah. it. They just listen. It's very different to Italian audience right. who just like drinking and, and having fun. <laughs> but uh, Berlin, we're not going to say all Italians are like that. No, by the way. <laughs> not, not at all. All Italians. But You're just, from there, though. So that's yeah, okay. yeah, they like listening to music, but not really listening. Right. Berlin people, German people, I guess, uh, they like to listen, even though they don't know who you are. They are really interested, and oh, that's, that's nice. Yeah, they they give you a good vibe. Yeah. And uh, so you uh, originally from Italy. Uh, you have got a few EPs out in Italian. Is that is that right? Yeah, I've got a couple of singles in Italian right. when I was still part of everyone's game. Right. Yeah, and okay. I was still speaking following. the language that they told you to speak. Yeah. <laughs> and exactly. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> And how easy is it to um, to go from doing Italian singles to doing uh, ones in English? Uh, actually, it was harder for me to sing in Italian because right. uh, I always sang in English and then all the people came and said, no, you have to right. try making it in Italy. And, but it didn't really work because I, I, I wasn't feeling it. So right. if you don't feel it, then it's not worth doing it. You're, uh, you're, you're also known for playing with a ukulele. Yeah. Have you been doing that recently or are you sticking with guitars? Um, um, yeah, I play ukulele all the time, but it's not my main instrument. Right. Maybe in a gig I play a couple of songs ukulele because right. it's like a, it's not a really, it doesn't have many chances of do of doing like loads of. It's a one trick pony, really, isn't it? Yeah, I think a couple <laughs> of songs are enough. Yeah, yeah. Um, and tell me about this particular guitar because you've just come back from uh, the south of the USA. Yeah. And you got this there, is that right? Yeah, I just bought this Martin from 1972 in a vintage guitar I'm gonna store. Like, I don't want I was knocking it before <laughs> and I was a bit nervous, but in the, yeah. in Nashville yeah. and yeah, I was just looking for a guitar and I, I, I tried I think like 30 guitars around Nashville for a whole week. Yeah. And I didn't find the perfect one. Then I picked this one up and I didn't leave it and I stayed <laughs> in the shop all day and I played it all day and I decided it was going to be mine. <laughs> And it sounds amazing. I mean, and some great um, sort of country music comes from the South of America. Is that was that what inspired you to go there? Yeah, we went there because of that. We went to Tennessee, Texas, uh, Louisiana, and we wanted to see all the main like milestones yeah. of country music. Yeah. Oh, and now you're back in London. How long are you back in London for? I'm actually planning to move here, and so I'm oh, going great. back and forth for a while. Uh, but yeah. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? And so uh, you've got we've got your EP coming out in December. Is there anything else we should look forward to, forward to? Any gigs or anything? I'm gonna be on tour uh, early next year. Okay. And dates are not out yet, but soon. It's all a surprise. It's yeah. all a secret. But stay watching all of your social media channels. I'm yeah, sure we'll find absolutely. it all. Great. Well, thank you very much. That was thank really you. amazing. You've been watching Balcony TV London, and we'll see you next time. Balcony TV.